Hi, thanks for joining me for this episode of Beyond the Curb River City Living. I'm Jill Morenz with the Catalytic Fund. I have a really special property to show you today. It's a row house in Ludlow, Kentucky that was rescued from a disastrous condition and made into a really cool home. Let's take a look. The exclusive sponsor of this episode is Republic Bank, a bank where everyone feels welcome. Republic Bank, it's just easier here. This is the disastrous addition I was telling you about. The Ludlow Historic Society bought that unit, tore it down to the studs, and remade it into something amazing. Cameron Williams bought it during the makeover and lives there with his poodle, Red. My sister's friend that lives in Ludlow told me about this property she was working on, she was doing the interior design for. And it was too cool of an opportunity to pass up, uh, essentially redoing a historic home from the ground up. So it was a just awesome opportunity. Just that, that's historic, that the ceilings are huge. Um, there's plenty of space. We kept the original floors and the outside and just have the character. It's very different than any of the new homes. Um, it just, it's unique. Hearth room. That is used uh, to be lazy. I love just to lay back there, turn the fire on, watch the movies, um, perfect for the winter time and just to relax. So I love living in Ludlow because of the community. Uh, everyone's incredibly friendly. It's, uh, I'd like to say, artsy community. You have a bunch of weird, funky shops. It's nice to be able to wake up, walk down the street, get coffee or get whatever you need from the grocery store. Everything you need is in Ludlow. Overall, just a great community. The great part about Ludlow is I can walk outside of my house and hop on my bike and uh, I can either follow the river and have a beautiful scenic route or I can hop downtown. I don't have to worry about parking. You can ride everywhere and everything's within 10-15 minutes of what you need. So it's been really nice living down here. I redid that home uh, or redid my office once COVID started and having to work from home and it's, I thought I would hate working from home, but having everything down here in Ludlow, being able to break up the day by walking down to the store to get some food or whatever the case may be. I love it now. It's been uh, just fantastic. I redo my office exactly how I wanted it. And uh, yeah, it's just, it's been, it was a blessing in disguise. Here's another dramatic before and after. This is the living room. It's hard to believe it's the same space, although you can see the original brick and the wood floors. One of the clever space-saving tricks of this home is right behind me. The top of the basement stairs also serves as the coat closet, and the whole thing can be concealed behind the sliding teal barn door. The living room is bright and comfortable. This long wall is the perfect place for Cam to showcase his growing collection of quirky portraits, most of which he finds at estate sales. More portraits contribute to the playful quality of the kitchen. There's a lot of drama in here too, with the stone backsplashes, sleek gray cabinets that hide the appliances, and this great chandelier. And then you're brought right back to the playful side with these big whimsical wooden knobs. The washer and dryer are in here too, and the whole room is given structure by the strict black and gray color scheme. The hearth room at the back of the house is an addition that has a high efficiency fireplace, slate floors, and a comfy couch. Longtime Cincinnati residents will recognize these signs that Cam's mom found at an antique store. The first floor powder room has what has to be the cutest, tiniest sink in Northern Kentucky. On the landing going upstairs, the wallpaper is very old and was saved during the renovation for a touch of history. Cam has made it fun with the addition of these tongue-in-cheek trophy heads. The master bedroom is a serene oasis. As you can see in this before photo, the window trim was green, a color that Cam liked so much he had it replicated in lead-free paint so he could keep it. The hats over the bed belong to his grandfather's. The black and white tiles in the bathroom are new, 
but here you can see a peek of the old medicine cabinet that Cam loves. Here's the hearth room seen from the back patio. Cam has a parking space right behind that gate. Thanks so much for joining me for our tour of this rescued row house in Ludlow, Kentucky. I invite you to take a look at our website, beyondthecurb.org, for all of our episodes, as well as additional photos and information about the properties that we've featured. I'm Jill Morenz, and on behalf of the Catalytic Fund and our sponsors, thanks for coming Beyond the Curb with us. Beyond the Curb is presented by the Catalytic Fund, a company that through its investments and real estate expertise, executes high impact real estate projects in Northern Kentucky and creates new spaces for living, working and entertainment.